Hi, I'm Sam Robinson. Welcome to my studio on Burnside Farm. This is an old place that my family's owned since 1860, and I'm lucky enough to have one of the old buildings uh, turned into my art studio. So uh, why don't you come on in and we'll uh, take a look at the show I'm working on for the Maryland Horse Breeders Foundation. This part of my studio is, is kind of like a little gallery, and I use it to hang the work that I'm putting together for a show. So, so far we have about 30 pieces, paintings and drawings that are starting to come together. So some of these are just different aspects of the horse world, which I'm getting more and more interested in as I explore it and trying to find different aspects of it that might, might uh, create a kind of a, an artistic point of view. And, and some of them are just kind of fun to do. Like this, this turkey here is a mascot up at uh, Graham Motion's uh, training yard. Just lives in the barn, but he's pretty great, so I thought he, uh, he deserved to be in the show. Further, So I uh, got introduced to some people, in particular Cricket, Goodall, and the Maryland Horse Breeders Association, and, and kind of all the connections from there, and uh, she and others have very generously introduced me to a whole other part of the horse world. So I've been spending more and more time looking into that. We, we hatched the idea for this show, which is to benefit the uh, the Horse Industry Foundation, and the idea was to sort of explore the whole scene and, and begin to kind of uh, describe that. Uh, my, my goal in a show like this is to try to make that particular world recognize itself when they come to the show and, and look at the paintings and the drawings. The things I'm finding happening as I get into this subject is there's certain things that catch your eye, big race moments and you know a great looking horse. But there are all these little corners of what's going on, people doing the work, uh, just the different kind of characters that populate it. One of the things I've sort of uh, come to understand is that we have a tremendous amount of people who are great photographers that really cover the subject. And it's really their job to get the detail. And they, you know, they, they're looking for that specific moment and that kind of sharp detail or, or an action shot frozen. But to me, that's not what an artist uh, is about. Uh, maybe in the past that was something that an artist needed to do, but nowadays we don't really need to do that. So our role is more to kind of get the feeling of the thing, try to try to get the spirit of it, try to get the uh, the flavor, and and in order to accomplish that, I use a looser style. So my brushwork is a little more uh, kind of quick and bold, uh, kind of let the colors be more expressive. Try to get a sense mostly of the light. And you, I've always started thinking of the show as kind of one big continuous scene that we're just seeing different parts of through various windows that are the picture frames. It's almost like, you know, one thing connects to the other. Go from one part of the track to the other, you go from, you know, go from the farm, you know, out, out to a different venue. And, you know, this person might show up here, the same horse might turn up in another picture. It's, it's kind of all like a continuum that I'm uh, kind of finding bits and pieces of to show to you.